Do you feel like you're constantly making an effort while the other person seems to be playing it cool? You feel like you're putting in all the effort, but the other person doesn't seem to be reciprocating your feelings. You start to question whether they really care about you or if you're just an option to them. If so, you've come to the right place. In this video, we'll be discussing the eight signs that you're just an option to them. By the end of this video, you'll have a clearer understanding of the signs to look out for if you're feeling like you're just an option to him. Our goal is to empower you to make informed decisions about your relationship and to help you avoid being used or taken for granted. So, if you're ready to learn more about the eight signs that you're just an option to them, make sure to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with our latest relationship advice and tip. Number one, he doesn't make an effort to keep the relationship going. It's important to be aware of the effort your partner is putting into the relationship. If you find that you're always the one taking the initiative to solve problems or make things better, it could be a sign that he doesn't see the relationship as a priority. A healthy relationship requires effort from both partners, and if he's not willing to put in the work, it's a sign that you may not be as important to him as he should be to you. Take the time to assess how much effort he's putting in and whether or not it's enough for you. If you're feeling like you're doing all the work and he's not meeting you halfway, it may be time to have a conversation with him about your concerns. Communication is key in any relationship, and it's important to be open and honest about your needs and expectations. Don't settle for being an option in his life, you deserve to be a priority. Number two, he only cares about his own desires. In any relationship, it's important for both partners to have their own wants and needs and to have some level of independence. However, if your partner is consistently putting their own desires first, without considering your feelings or needs, it could be a sign that they don't value you as much as they should. For example, if your partner always insists on doing things their way, or only wants to engage in activities that they enjoy, it could be a sign that they're not prioritizing your needs. If this behavior continues and becomes a recurring issue, it might be time to take a step back and think about the type of relationship that you want to be in. Remember, it's important to be with someone who cares about your feelings and is willing to compromise and make an effort to meet your needs. Number three, it's always your fault. Are you constantly being blamed for issues in your relationship, even when you try to make things better? Does your partner always turn things around on you and accuse you of being wrong or uncooperative? If this sounds familiar, it's a sign that your partner doesn't value your feelings or your perspective. Instead, their focus is on getting what they want rather than maintaining a healthy relationship. Being accused of wrongdoing, even when it's not your fault, is a clear sign that you're not a priority in your partner's life. This type of behavior can be emotionally draining and damaging to your self-esteem. If this is happening to you, it's important to have an honest conversation with your partner about how their behavior is affecting you. Remember, a healthy relationship requires mutual respect and a willingness to work through problems together. If your partner is unwilling to do this, it may be time to re-evaluate the type of relationship you want to be in. Number four, he doesn't show interest in your life. In a healthy relationship, showing interest in your partner's life is crucial. Whether it's asking about their day, their hobbies, or their passions, displaying genuine curiosity and care is a sign of appreciation and respect. However, if the person you're dating rarely shows any interest in your life, this can be a warning sign that you might not be a priority to them. In fact, Research has shown that people who are interested in each other tend to talk more often and for longer periods of time than those who lack interest. So, if your partner isn't making the effort to engage with you on a deeper level or show any sign of curiosity about your life, then it's worth considering whether this is the type of relationship you want to be in. It's important to recognize that not showing interest in your life isn't always intentional. 
Sometimes, people might be preoccupied with their own lives, stressed out, or just not in the right headspace to engage in meaningful conversation. However, if this lack of interest is a recurring pattern, then it's worth having an honest conversation with your partner about how you feel. Number five, he doesn't include you in his future plans. It's important to feel valued and appreciated in a relationship. And one way to gauge how much someone values you is to see how much they include you in their future plans. When a person is excited about their future, they tend to naturally want to include their partner in those plans. However, if your partner is intentionally leaving you out of their plans, it can be a sign that you're not a priority in their life. According to psychologists, when a man deliberately omits you from his future planning, it could be a sign that he doesn't view you as an essential part of his life. It can feel like you're just an afterthought, rather than a valued partner. For instance, if he doesn't introduce you to his friends or family, who are an integral part of his life, or he fails to consider your opinion when making decisions about future plans, it's a sign that you might not be a priority in his world. It's important to note that some people are just naturally independent and may not want to include their partner in all aspects of their life. However, if this lack of thoughtfulness and inclusion is a recurring issue and you feel like you're constantly being left out of important plans, it's worth having an honest conversation with your partner to address your concerns. Ultimately, you deserve to be with someone who sees you as an integral part of their life and includes you in their future plans. Number six, their weekends are booked solid. Have you ever found yourself wondering why your partner only seems to be available to see you at certain times, like a random Monday night? If so, you might want to listen to your gut. While it's possible that they simply have a busy schedule, it's also possible that there could be more going on behind the scenes. People generally use weekends for socializing and time off from a typical work week. This means that if your partner never seems to want to make plans with you on the weekends, it could be a sign that they are prioritizing someone else during that time. This could be a primary partner or someone they're dating more seriously than you. It's important to pay attention to these signs and trust your instincts. If you feel like something isn't quite right, it's worth having an open and honest conversation with your partner about your concerns. It's possible that they have a valid reason for their schedule, but it's also possible that they may be hiding something from you. Ultimately, you deserve to be with someone who is fully committed to you and your relationship. Number seven, you don't like how you feel. At times, it can be challenging to determine whether you are just a backup option for someone, but it's crucial to listen to your intuition and pay attention to how you feel in the relationship. It's essential to understand that you deserve to be respected, loved, and accepted for who you are. If you're questioning whether you're happy in the relationship, or if this is how you envision your life, it's time to reflect on your priorities. While it's possible for the relationship to evolve into something more meaningful, it's not worth waiting around indefinitely for someone to make up their mind. Communicating what you're looking for and being honest about your feelings can help you determine if the relationship is worth continuing. However, if the other person shows no indication of prioritizing you or making any changes, it might be time to consider moving on to find someone who will value and prioritize you. Remember, you deserve to be with someone who puts you first and makes you feel loved and appreciated. Number eight, they reappear when they need something. It's not uncommon to want to be there for someone you care about when they need help or attention. However, if this seems to be the only time you hear from them, it's worth questioning their intentions. If someone is interested in being your partner, they would make an effort to communicate with you more regularly, not just when it suits them. It's important to note that you can still be there for them when they need you, but if you feel like you're always the one reaching out and never receiving the same effort in return, it might be time to speak up. It's okay to ask where the relationship is headed and if you're both on the same page. At the end of the day, you deserve to be with someone who is interested in building a relationship with you, not just using you as a convenient option. 
In conclusion, if you're experiencing any of these signs in your relationship, it's time to re-evaluate whether you're truly a priority in your partner's life or just an option. Remember that you deserve someone who values you and treats you with the love and respect you deserve. Don't settle for being someone's second choice or backup plan. Keep your standards high and never forget your worth. And for those of you who haven't experienced these signs, always strive to communicate openly and honestly with your partner and make sure they feel valued and loved in your relationship. Thank you for watching, and if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content on relationships and personal growth.